I figured my days playing football were over. I wouldn't make a normal Sunday league team the way I am. I decided to start something on my own. It's helped so many people and I realised I wasn't alone. My name is Gary Thorne and I'm the founder of Denny Warriors Football Club. I'm in Scotland today to meet Gary Thorne. He has an amazing story to tell and I can't wait to meet him. Guys, you okay? How's it going, buddy? All right? Good, nice yeah. to see you. Nice to see you. So the Denny Warriors is a, a football club that I set up that supports overweight men with poor mental health. I had put the idea out there on the Denny Town Facebook page and it blew up. I did it on 24th of July last year on a Friday night, 8 o'clock at night, and I was there to 1 o'clock in the morning answering messages from guys. For me, myself, I never thought I'd be back playing 11 aside football, and just recently I scored my first goal 11 aside for the Warriors. Those moments are what, are what changes things for people. Cheers, guys. So have you always lived here and around this area? Uh, no, I'm originally from uh, Glasgow, southside of Glasgow. When you moved here, did you know anyone? No, uh, outside of my wife and her family, uh, no, this was a completely strange place to me. And although I had my family, um, we didn't have our own space, we were living out of a bedroom at the time. And uh, yeah, uh, it was a really, really diff difficult time for myself. I blamed myself, big style. Um, when we made the move through to Denny and didn't have a home, uh, immediately I, I felt like a failure. I, I was convinced that it was my fault that this this was the situation we were in. But it was bad, I mean, at times, at times I questioned whether or not my family were better off without me. Um, if I'm honest. So what was the toughest thing you felt, even for not just you, you're also your family, in terms of that move from Glasgow to Denny? Oh, I think that was the, the toughest part was the actual, um, I was still working in, in Glasgow at the time. Um, I wasn't getting in the house till sometimes quarter past, half past six at night. Missing the kids um, took a toll on me. We got lucky with a house that came on the market. That was like a, a, like a light at the end of the tunnel, you know, we had that own place and feeling like I'd achieved something for my family again. And once I sort of stabilised myself, I then started thinking, well, now that I'm settled, getting back to what I want to do, and that's obviously football. You know, what you've done with uh, Denny Warriors, I think, is, is inspirational, and now you're giving that, you know, these players and these people a little push also and giving them that little bit of support base. So that's, you know, well done to you, mate. I don't have a lot in my life I would say I'm particularly proud of, other than my kids and my wife, um, but the team's definitely up there. What does Denny Warriors mean to you? Denny Warriors means everything to me. It's not just about the football, you know, the football is the bonus. It's, it's the friendships that have been made from it, it's the connections, because we know everybody is fighting battles. Whether it's battles with weight or whether it's mental health, whatever it might be, we stand together and we're fighting together. So this is home, Ash, Oakville View Stadium. Home of the Denny Warriors. Denny Warriors, that's us, yep. So, guys, how does it make you feel walking in here, you know, through these gates? It's not a park. You've got a beautiful stadium here. Yeah, it's amazing. I never thought for, for a second we would end up here. Uh, we went from playing on a, an overgrown grass park with no lines and, and goals that were falling apart to, um, to standing out on this park every week. It's, it's just amazing to, to see how far we've come. What makes Denny Warriors so special? I think for me it's the guys here in the club. You know, for example, take, take, we've got a player, Barry, who, who uh, has been through quite a rough story. And he kind of found himself in a position where he didn't really want to do anything. You know, he, he didn't have a lot of confidence to go out and about. And everybody in the, in the group um, sort of really kind of drove on, you know, we're here for you, we can go for a coffee, all this sort of stuff, you know, and it was, for me, sitting back watching that was just amazing. The best part of being with uh, the Denny Warriors is, you know, having a team behind me that support me. I've made a lot of friends here since I started. As I say, these guys didn't know each other a few months before, and every one of them showed their support, and I think that was really special. So uh, as part of the um, Key United project, we've obviously benefited through that from the, the mental health training that they provided. We had a, a player come to us, and he can explain that there was a few things going on in his life, and um, actually had him considering, you know, the ultimate decision. I very quickly remembered, you know, what we had just learned and was able to put it into practice. And I'm glad to say that he's actually he's joined up as a member and we talked about what options he has to, to better his situation and stop him feeling the way he does. Guys, the whole day you've been telling me about your team, but are you any good? Well, let's show you what we can do then. Yeah, I want to see. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a bit, he's played before. He's played before. Yeah, this is what I want to see, come on. Oh, 
You know, you look at inspiration and, and, and leaders, and, and Gary's certainly that. Again, through Kevin United, I think it gives him a, a better insight on, on how to deal with people. He's really got a, a good understanding now of you know, how to treat himself, but also how to use that and, and help teammates. That's why Carlin and Calm coming together and creating Kevin United is going to make a big difference. I think seeing what's going to come from this is, uh, is only going to benefit the team. You know, we're, we're going to be able to get more guys in, we're going to be able to support guys better, and that's kind of our, our, main, our main logo is, you know, you're, you're not going to be alone anymore. When you're in the Warriors, you're going to, you're going to still have your, your bad days and you're still going to struggle, but you're going to have an army behind you now. Get your club involved with Caring United. New kits, mental health training and a stronger club.